Spending countless hours preparing for a great showing of the one-act plays, Mr. Brazar worked endlessly to prepare his students for yet another great production. The one-act plays was a series of plays constructed and completely student-involved. Student directing, acting, and writing made up the heart of the one-act plays as a large student involvement was artistically displayed. I thought the one-acts, uh, the Revolutions Festival, which we call it, uh, was a big hit. Uh, this year. It was a second year. Um, both of our shows uh, sold out and I think it's really um, a nice example of how our theater program is really, really, the numbers are growing, people who are showing up are growing. Um, there was great enthusiasm to the plays. Uh, the one thing I really loved about the plays really showed a sense of imagination. Devoting over 20 hours a week to the one-act play, students expressed their great appreciation for such a spectacular core of rehearsals put forth by Mr. Bazar. We have a very stressful rehearsal schedule before our show. It's like four hours every night, basically. Good morning. And um, I'm going to we did a few run through, and Mr. Bazar gave us very detailed notes, and they're important how to like make your statues. Although many students only acted in these plays, some of them were fortunate enough to not only act but direct these plays that were being displayed in this presentation. I was lucky enough to be able to write for the one act plays and direct for the one act plays. So for me, a big thing was that. As a writer, I was able to look at things from one perspective and then also to look at them again from the perspective of someone who wanted to put it together and have some actors also be able to work on the material and to guide them in that. The spring carries on. The one-act plays have brought a beautiful sense of imagination to the Benjamin community, and we cannot wait to see what's in store for next year's production. Reporting from BTV News Channel 3, this is Demaya Preston.